So this is your, this is the process day in, day out. Yep. I love it. If you enjoy what you do, you never work a day in your life. Meet two of the Banana Boogie Bakers. Hannah is the Bake Seals Australian Champion 2018. Her favourite pie is the chicken satay. This is Jason, owner, baker, perfectionist. The hazard of Jason's job is taste testing all of his goods. There's no like secrets in here, mate, that I'm gonna give away. Nah, nah. <laughs> Triple pepper pie, we had peppercorns. I spent an eye-opening morning watching the baking process unfold. This is how I saw it. Some people will do the other way of doing pie bottom and they'll just put all the ingredients in together. Which the point of the pie bottom is to get the fat and the flour mixed together so then it, it doesn't make it so tough, it makes it a nice short yeah. eating pastry. So you do that and then you add your water and then that's how you so it's like two stages of your dough, you mix the flour and the fat together, then you put your water in, mix that and then you put more flour in again after that. And there's different grades of flour and stuff like that, like um, high protein levels and stuff. Like we use a high protein level flour to make bread with, but a low one for making pastry so it's nice and soft. The high bottom's gotta be the same thickness as your top, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, This is a lot of algae and eggs and stuff. A lot of people, have you got egg on your pie? No. And then it's vegan friendly because it's made with all natural yeah. stuff. So, yeah, most growing up making pies, it's always egg, milk, and a little bit of salt. But 90% of bakeries actually use this glaze that we use now. This is our mushroom mix, steak and mushroom. And a lot of people will just put steak mix in and then a bit of mushy on top. But we mix mushy through yeah. to every bite you have. 
and the colour of it, like a lot of them you'll see are very light. Like look how dark ours is like. Well I, I said I think in the cup, a couple of ones ago, it has to like, it's so much more appetising when it looks. It's got the gravy yeah. look about it, you know what I mean? If you add like a caramel colour to it. Yeah. Um, like I said before, a lot of baked peas will use meat pie complete, which is just put some scoop, two scoops of that and a bit of cold water, yeah. and then add that to your yeah. But we add everything. There's no like secrets in here, mate, that I'm gonna give away. Nah. <laughs> And that helps for the ceiling. Yeah, everything and just a mess, you know what I mean? Pies get baked at a really high temperature for a shorter amount of time. The filling's already baked, you're only going to bake the pastry. You only get a pie and cut it open and there's nothing in there. You don't want too much in there because you get boil out or it's used out the side. And you get that from bakeries that don't know what they're doing. They'll bake it at a lower temperature for longer and then the filling boils and yeah. pushes the lid off of the pie. Triple pepper pie. So this is the, uh, the gold award winner. Yes. First time in your one. So what's the water for again, mate? Just keep the two pastries stuck together. So we're about to put the top on. You don't need, even our sausage rolls, some of the tradies go, I've never had a sausage roll, or I haven't had this round in sauce. Yeah. Because we have you know, flavor, you know, garlic, onion. And then the whole sauce bottle argument, oh, I hate it. It's, um, you gotta think about what that bottle is doing for approximately eight hours a day. And this mix you're chucking on, mate? This is to... This is to give it a nice colour in the oven. Yeah. Nice and shiny. Is it adding anything? No flavour, no taste-wise, nothing. Um, depends as well, like we're putting seeds in these pies, so lots of seeds, six or five. I like 
like um, you said last time as well about the different like the ways to symbolise them as well, like put the mush mushroom on top. Yep. Like put it on top. Yeah. Put cheese and bacon on top of the cheese and bacon. So when you get to the car, they're like, yeah. oh, oh, that's my fire there. Yeah, I was gonna say, are you allowed to say what's in there, mate? Uh, we got cracked pepper, pepper steak, a bit of white pepper, a little bit of uh, ground black pepper. These are the ones we prepared earlier. I say we like I did it. Oh, jeez. Golden brown. Maybe another minute in the oven, a little bit light. Much. Maybe another minute. So is that on the same same heat the whole time, mate? Those yeah, set at 230. Yeah. A high heat on the bottom to give them nice and brown. Oh, so it's Lower heat on the top. top. Yeah, because you've got elements you got at the front. So we go lower at the top, higher at the bottom to give it a lot of heat to get that pie baked. Yeah. I always watch those shows where they're at the place and they go, oh, this is so good. And I'm like, this But that is actually the best one I've had. Really? Yeah. There's no way I was leaving though without seeing that famous banana boogie vanilla slice. You said you're gonna make what two is about 200 slices, right? For the day, yes. For Saturday, yeah. And it's and they'll sell out. They will sell out before lunch. World famous. The pastry we use on the vanilla is the same as what's on top of the pie. Oh yeah? Yeah. And it's the same thickness too.